friends welcome to aqua blue boutique if you guys are new here my name is z and welcome to the channel so before um, i go into this video i would like you guys to hit the uh, thumbs up and the bell notification and subscribe to this channel for more content so in this channel we will be covering uh, topics on embroidery sewing etsy shop um, running a home business being a mom those type of thing and a little bit about budgeting finance and a little bit of computer work so today is just gonna be a work with me video so it's already two days since the impression expo so i'm back so i'm back to reality you guys so reality is um getting my work done and over the four days that i was gone i only have three etsy order plus the order that i didn't finish which which was the adult shirt but the lady didn't need until February 18th, so my um, ship date would be January 31st, so I need to get it done before by January 31st to ship it out in time for her. And then on Facebook, I have um, seven orders, so that's all I have to work on. And I hopefully, um, after the Facebook thing, I'm not gonna uh, post any more things on Facebook so I can uh, focus on doing more of my computer work and you know filming for you guys and doing quality tutorial for you guys and i also have an unboxing video of just all the equipment that i buy to upgrade my uh, content here on youtube for you guys so um, we will look into all the new equipment sometime this week i'm gonna set a time this week i think it's gonna be a live i'm not sure if it's gonna be a live or a video i might be doing a video and then premiering for you guys and so that's what's coming up and that's all i have to say you guys so just back to work from a four day getaway so yeah i'm just gonna put on time lapse and we're just gonna work together today and if you guys have any comment question anything you guys can leave in the uh, comment down below or just simply say hi so i know who you guys are so you guys take care Hey ladies, so it's 11.53 now, uh, California time, and to me and Cloud already have lunch, so I'm going to take a break and take Cloudy for a little walk, because he's getting a little bit fuzzy, so I'm going to take him out to do some kind of activity at the park nearby here, so, so he let out his energy so he can take a nap so I can do more of the work, um, I think I did three shirt this morning. So I still have a little bit to go. And then once I'm done, I need to clean this whole area. And yeah, I gotta clean off and then I gotta edit some videos for you guys and just do a little bit of computer work. So you guys, I had my tea this morning and because Cloud been keeping me busy, I didn't even get a drink yet. So it's just been sitting there for, it's already cold, but um, I'm still gonna drink a little bit. Eh? Okay, okay, we're gonna go. So I will see you guys later in the afternoon when I put Clown down so I can um, finish most of the shirt. Okay, say bye ladies. Okay, say bye. Kissy. Mwah. Okay, bye. bye. See you later ladies. Bye. See you later. Hey you guys. So it's already 4 p.m. in the evening and my two girls are already back from school. I already ate my dinner already. <laughs> so I tried to eat dinner before 5 p.m. So now I'm just coming back to finish the rest of the shirt. And I, Cloud just finally took his nap. I mean, I tried to put him to sleep at 2 p.m., but he didn't go to sleep until now. So I think that'll give me about two hours to um, get as much done as I can. So let's get to work, you guys. Let's do it. <laughs> Hey 
Hey friends, welcome to Aqua Blue Boutique. My name is Z, if you guys are new. Today is just going to be a work with me video log. So if you guys can hit the thumbs up, that'll help my channel up a lot. I'll appreciate it. And also subscribe and put that bell notification on so you guys can get notified when I post up video and follow along my journey, you guys, if you guys want to. Um, so today I am just finishing what I left off yesterday. And today is January the 26th, Wednesday. It's 4.36 a.m. right now, but I was up since 3.30 just editing some video for you guys. So I'm not entirely finished with the editing, but I think I'm almost done. So I will upload the work with me video log from last week. And then um, we're just going to get to work, you guys. So I have all these orders. You see this? Uh, it's going to fall, so I'm not going to take it out. So I need to touch all those and then I need to finish and board some shirt. So from Facebook, I only have two more orders left. And then on Etsy, I, I have two, but then one just came in this morning. So I have three now to finish. So hopefully tomorrow, um, I'll finish everything with tomorrow so I can put some time into organizing my room, you guys. If you guys don't know, I've been working really hard this month but just trying to work around the etsy shop um, and my kids schedule um, i can only do a little bit every day so you get this seeing that i have this bookshelf now i'm changing the room up a little bit so it's getting there slowly and next month i will be sharing my organization tips with you guys um, i plan to do something about this i found a meat storage and i will share that with you guys these are like the applicate um like fabrics i've been putting them in these baggies like this but i'm gonna try to organize it better so we'll learn how to organize that and then how i organize fabrics and just little knickknacks around my table so i am trying to be more organized so things will be um easily like i can easily find them and then once i get these orders done and i have a little bit more time to friday and saturday i'm going to be creating a inventory sheets for my blinks because blinks are really important for uh, running at t-shirt shops so i need to know exactly how much i have and when to order so i don't run out and try to order something like just for one customer um if i don't have the size just for one customer i wouldn't even take the order you guys um that just me because it's not worth it to just to buy um i did that in the past for just one customer wanted a black long sleeve and well i was planning to order more shirt anyway so i just did it for her but if she didn't order at the time that i'm gonna make a, a purchase for my regular blinks then i'm not gonna even take the order you guys so it, it's good that my customer uh, on Etsy, they've been messaging me before they buy it because I need to know if I can accommodate them. So I put that down in my description saying like, if they are looking for something else other than what I listed, they need to convo, send me a convo because I need to check if I have it or I can accommodate them. So most of the time they do, I feel like they do read it because a lot of them do send me private convo. And but in the future, um, I'm probably just planning to do once a month um, restock. So it depends on how much I sell that month. If I don't make too much sale that month, then I'm not going to restock um, a lot of it. So I need to create that Excel, especially in the past. I show you guys I used the app shortly, but that one cost money. <laughs> and so, I mean, I think you can use a free version, but I was using the pay version and I don't like it anymore so and I don't think it's worth the money because I don't make too much and it's not I'm not using it as often so I'm gonna go with a simple excel sheet only and to track all the blanks and then maybe just have a log of all my threads what color threads I already have so I don't buy duplicate because I found myself but I mean I will only buy duplicate of the most used color thread but other than that, I don't need duplicates of the other color because I don't use the other color too much. I only have them on hand just in case I do a new design. Then I might try to match color or I need color in between. So that's why I have 
I don't know. I have a lot of blues, you guys. I just like blues, I guess. <laughs> Obviously, you guys know I like um, the shades of blue. I mean, aqua is the fair color, but technically, I like blues. And um, if you guys do like mermaid or like like you know ocean thing, kind of, I think the blues is really great. I mean, blues. You can use blue in any any design, but I don't know. <laughs> I just like blue, so. And a lot of the design I have, I use some a lot of blue too. So that's why I have blue and pinks. Um, before I didn't have a lot of greens, but I find that I do need some greens too. So I try to buy a variety of green here. Anyways, enough of uh, the thread talk. So we're gonna get to work. So now I am going to be cutting all my tender touch, and we're gonna tender touch this shirt while I load on. Uh, the shirt that I need to do on this and prep the next three shirts that I need to embroider later today. And we'll see how much I finish before Cloud wakes up. And today is an early release day for my kids. So I uh, need to try to finish as much as I can by 9 a.m. So it's almost five now. So I have five, six, seven, eight. Um, so about five hours till nine, okay? So is it six, seven, eight, nine? actually four <laughs> so four uh, four hours till till nine so i'm gonna try to finish as much as i can this four hours before clouds wake up because when he wake up it's like crazy you guys i can't i cannot work when he's awake because he just has a lot of energy so um when he wake up i just probably do a little bit of computer work and yeah and then I'll, i'm gonna come back and update you guys how's the day going so let's get to work you guys hey guys so before i start uh, working i forgot to tell you guys um i like to listen to audible now i just subscribe to it so i find books um on there that inspire me that has positivity or podcasts and i also listen to more meditative music <laughs> because they're so calming and positive that it really motivates me to uh, get my work done so you know, when I listen to those, I'm just more productive and I get more things done. So I'm going to be putting those on while I work and I'm just going to do time lapse for you guys. So you guys can see how, you know, I work and I have four hours till Clouds Awake. So let's do it, you guys. Let's get to work. You guys, so before I um, continue to work, this is my little trash can where I put all the um, needle that is not working anymore. Um, I need to change on the needle because I find on the shirt there um, is the it doesn't rip, but then I can see the hole like the holes a little bit more visible. So when you see that, um, you need to start changing your needle. So um, I haven't changed it for a while, so I'm gonna change it now. Um, this machine, uh, I think it's, I mean, I don't change it consistently. I know that you're supposed to, but I only change it when I start seeing that the shirts start having little, the holes a little bit bigger <laughs> than normal. It's a little bit visible on the side. So we're gonna be changing the needle right now. So I don't know if you guys want to see that, but I'm just going to do time lapse so you guys can see me change the needle. Okay. Hey guys. Today is already on uh, January 27th. Right now it's 6 p.m. California time. And it's already the next day of my work day. Um, I woke up today early at 5 a.m. But I mainly was just doing um, like fixing my Etsy and just editing video this morning. So I didn't get to um, do any embroidery, but I pack all these um, these are all the Facebook order so at least I 
finish this. This took me an hour to do tender touch and fold the shirt and make sure everything looked okay. So this took me the one hour in the morning and a little bit of the Etsy, fixing Etsy listing. And, and then that's all I did in the morning. And the whole day I would just hang out with Cloud. And I was super tired because I think I am a little bit burnt out. So um, I took a long afternoon nap. So in the morning, I would just hang out with Cloud and watching Angela's live. So today, Angela went live in the morning. So I would just hang out there. And then by 2 p.m., I just uh, took a long nap because I just woke up around 6 p.m. now. So I have to stay up a little bit later today since I took a long nap. In the afternoon so I am gonna stay up at least till 10 p.m. because usually I go to bed at 9 p.m. but since today I took a longer nap I can stay up till 10 p.m. and I'm gonna try to finish um, all the Etsy orders so I only have five Etsy order left to do so I think I could knock out at least two today and then probably the rest would be tomorrow because the other three are like the newer order that just came in like in the last two days so i will um do those tomorrow if i cannot finish all five so let's get to work you guys gotta be productive now since the whole day i only tend to touch those shirt that i show you guys so let's get to work guys so it's almost 8 30 p.m. in California so I think this is the last shirt I'm gonna do so I'm, I'm gonna uh, wrap it up since Klaus I mean Klaus just took a nap he just woke up so I'm, I'm just gonna go and relax with Klaus and I need to uh, do my little workout routine before I go to bed so I'm gonna see you guys in the next video okay so I'm gonna wrap up my work when this finish embroidering so I'll see you guys in the next video, you guys. Bye, take care. Hey guys, so today's already the next day of my work with me video log. It's Friday the 28th and it's 6 a.m. here in California. Um, normally I wake up around 4 a.m. But I mean, I was awake at 5 today, but since I was um, not feeling a lot of energy this morning, so I uh, stay in bed a little bit longer. So just got ready and um, trying to start my day right now so today is my ship date um, I have limited myself to only two ship date per week so I don't have to try to go to the post office every day because you know like every day when I finish one or two orders I would just take them to the post office but I find that that's too much work on me um, so I'm gonna only schedule Monday and Wednesday now because usually i don't really schedule because i don't know when the shirt's gonna be done so that's why i don't schedule um pickup date and i know a lot of people recommend that because it's, it'll be easier for you so the, you know you don't have to be taking your kids to the post office all the time but sometimes it doesn't work for me because when you request a pickup they don't come till the next day you guys so um I want to make sure like I, like at least I get everything packaged like this you know they have to be ready to go in this I just have to slap the label on then I will request a pickup if it's not ready like that then I don't want to request a pickup so so then sometimes I will have to wait till the next day to get it all packaged up and ready to go and then I'll just drop it off later that afternoon you know so that's why I keep going to the post office but then now I'm going to try to, um, you know, schedule everything the day before Monday. So if I have to do a pickup on Monday, I'm going to schedule on Sunday. So then they can pick it up on Monday. And then I'm going to set an, another pickup day on Wednesday. But if I don't have any order between Monday to Wednesday, then I'm not going to even set up a Wednesday pickup day. And then I'll just do a Friday pickup day. 
I'm gonna try that. So I know that, hey, I gotta get this order done by Thursday night. So you have to request before midnight the day before for them to pick it up the next day. So I know that. So now I have to um, say, hey, Monday through Thursday, well, Monday to Wednesday order needs to be shipped on Friday. And then Friday to Thursday to Sunday orders need to ship out on Monday morning. So I think I'm gonna do that. So Monday through Wednesday orders going to be shipped on Friday. And then Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday order will be shipped on Monday. So that will be uh, easier for me now because I put my processing time about five business day. Well, I did five to seven business days. So um, that should give me plenty of time. Like I've tried to get it out within four days, but I just put seven days just in case you guys. I mean, it's better to have a longer processing time, especially if you are a stay at home mom. So it will be um, easier and less stress for you. Um, especially these uh, applicate shirt takes a little bit of time. So even with one or two shirt orders, um, it's, I can only do like probably three the most for me <laughs> with one more tiny needle. And plus I go to bed earlier now that you know I have to um, cut off my work time around eight to nine ish so like i have to cut off that time so i can wake up at four um i think i've been waking up at four and three and it was a little bit tiring because some night i did went past nine so i i can't really go like wake up at 5 a.m so just like yesterday i think went past a little bit 10. so yeah so today um, I start off my day a little bit late, but it's okay because I'm almost finished with the Etsy. And then I'm just going to go do stuff on the computer, social media, and clean the room a little bit because it's a little bit messy now. So you guys, that's all I'm going to share with you guys, like my plans of how I'm going to um, just take, you know, how I'm going to deliver my items to my customer and make it less stress for me. So we will see how that goes you guys and i'll talk to you guys um in the next video okay you guys so let's get to work you guys hey guys so it's almost 9 a.m so taking in a little bit break because cloud woke up at eight so since eight o'clock um i only did one shirt so i'm just baking some sweet potato i love sweet potato you guys i'm just trying to eat a little bit healthier so you know um i can function better because i think when i eat better it just makes me feel better so i don't know if you guys like sweet potato but they're pretty good and healthy i think it has less carb than um the white potato like the regular potato i don't know which potato is that but i think the the one that's white inside um that one has more starch and carbs so if you want a healthier one, um, sweet potato is good. So taking a break and then I'll go back and work, you guys. Hey, you guys. So um, I just made myself a little snack that you guys saw in the last clip. So I haven't eaten my snack yet. I just finished baking it. So now I'm just back here. We're gonna do, um, I just have two more shirt and then I'm completely done with order, you guys. So in the next, um, we only have 29, 30, 31. We have three more days till February, okay? So in the next three days, I'm gonna work really hard to try to do a challenge for myself for February. And if you guys wanna join along, hopefully um, you guys can join along because it's just gonna be more for like small business organization, you guys. Last year, I. I mean, before starting the business, I did some sort of organization, but over time, I found things that doesn't really work for me. So I'm gonna try to set up a new system and find new storage solution for certain things. Um, I found a storage solution for this applique. I don't like how it's all like smashing here. So I found one from uh, Amazon and we will go through um, like, I'm gonna do 30 days. I know that February doesn't have 30 days, but 
I'm going to do 30 days of small business um, organization challenge just for myself. I think, I don't know the name yet, but I think that's what the name I'm going to name it. And I'm going to start off with organizing my paperwork, you guys. Um, paperwork is the most important for me now because when I start, I just put like my tax number, everything like in like a messy binder. So <laughs> I'm going to start with that. So those of you that have not um, get like your uh, EIN number or your sales tax ID number, like maybe this will kind of give you guys an idea of you know how to uh, store it so we're gonna go from doing paperwork to probably like section i'm gonna divide this room into sections so i will explain that later um i don't know how i'm gonna tackle it yet because i'm still in the process of planning now so i have three days to try to plan out so anyways let's get to work i need to get to work and then i'm gonna sit down and just start planning um the challenge for next month I do want to do a little bit of sewing too, so probably in between we'll do some, some sewing. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be just sitting down today planning my month of February. Okay, while I finish the last two Etsy order, then I'm free, you guys. I'm free to uh, plan for uh, YouTube content for you guys and just uh, to focus on myself and do, do other things because I really need to get this small business a little bit organized you guys because without organization it's kind of like i don't have clarity you guys like when i come in here all i know what to do is just finish etsy order and then after i finish the etsy order i don't know what else i need to do so once i set up my system and organize my paperwork then i will you know know that hey this is the central location where i have um all of my paperwork so if i need to do bulk order if I need to reference my uh, sales tax I is it I don't think it's a sale tax see that's the thing like um, people get confused with this term I get confused I think it's a resales tax license Didn't work, okay talk to you guys later So it's already Friday night. It's 8, 19 p.m. already. Um, I didn't accomplish going to the post office today because I went out to have lunch with my husband in the afternoon and then I took Cloud to the mall. So we did some fun time together. So I kind of put everything on the back burner. So now um, I need to finish these tomorrow to tend to touch them i already embroidered all of them so tomorrow i really have to ship it out because everything needs to be there um, you know by february 10 and 14 so tomorrow is the latest so i will wake up tomorrow early morning to tend to touch all of these shirts so we have valentine we have a strawberry one and then this is an adult one somebody asked for a custom adult long sleeve um i have to press it so it's a little bit wrinkly so i want to press everything and tender touch even this adult one I'm, i have to tender touch it so this design was small but i have to stretch it and i think it still turned out pretty neat even i stretch it pretty wide to fit like the largest hoop. So, then it turned out pretty good. So we have to turn or touch this one. And then this is the Valentine shirt. So and then the last one is this one. This one has to ship priority, so. Or, because the person won it on February the 3rd. So hopefully, I mean, I already told her and she said she was hoping She's just gonna take her chance. So if it doesn't get there, um, she can't come back and tell me that because I already told her then and she said, yeah, she'll just take the risk and she pay um, the priority shipping. So yeah, so these are all the shirt. 
that I need a tender touch tomorrow um, wrap it up and then put it in with the other one I mean I finished up this morning you guys see that but since I didn't want to go to the post office uh, today and then go tomorrow again I decided to just wait until I finish all these so we can go just one time to the post office and drop everything off tomorrow and those are Easter shirts so um, they can they don't have to ship today so I can wait tomorrow anyways I'm not gonna work tonight because I don't know I'm just so drained today <laughs> I have no more energy so I really just gonna go to bed I already took a shower so you guys see my hair is a little wet so I'm just going to go to bed and wake up really early tomorrow and get these done and ship them out you guys and then I have to do some computer stuff I know I always say computer stuff I like that's like the last thing on my mind like all the order has to be done first and then whatever I want to do on the computer and social media and then I will um, designate time because my whole energy is is just running my house my kids and getting fulfilling the Etsy order so whatever computer work I need to do or learn something on it then that will be like when I have the energy and when I'm done with all my work right so anyways I'll see you guys in the next um, video log so the video log for work with me this week will end with this video so stay tuned to uh, so for um, this week video log January um, 20 where I started on Wednesday so Wednesday Thursday and Friday today is Alexa what's today today is Friday January 28th by the way you have a five dollars credit for Kindle purchases using your echo device would you like to learn more no no problem to learn more go to amazon okay alexa stop so <laughs> alexa's talking to me so anyways um yeah so we started on wednesdays which is the 26th so the video log will end today and then next week if i have anything that i want to share with you guys we'll do another video log and um, the video log will be like it's always gonna be the previous week okay so whenever I post on Wednesday it's already the previous week so I'm I try to document like two one to two or one to three days during um, the previous week and then I will edit it and show it to you guys the following week so hopefully you guys like these type of um, how's my work week or you know work days like well typically it's gonna be a work weekday because i am trying to film like over a course of two or three days of how i work it's not gonna be every day because i might not have work every day so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video you guys take care i'll see you guys in the next video law bye <laughs>
please like and subscribe. Bye. See you next time. Bye. Mm.